Come on, dance with us, Tom. Tom. <laughs> I'm dancing in oh, for okay. him. He's dancing in his Bow. head. Okay. okay, welcome back, everybody. I'm a little bit scared of you because you just broke a board. I'm a karate master right now, okay? You are. Ha, ha. Okay. okay, listen. All right, so now today... These guys both <laughs> make me nervous. <laughs> Today, we are doing a project on Canvas, all right? And you yeah. probably know all about this now. I love it. What is Canvas usually used for? People usually paint yes. on Canvas, mm -hmm. Tom. They use acrylic and uh, even oil paints. Yeah. But today, we're doing something a little bit different. Okay, it started with this. This is just something fun to do. You can put it on an easel like this and set it in your home, or you can mm -hmm. actually put it on the wall. I would say this might be for a little girl's room, possibly. Um, so what we did is we went to the um, section where I'm doing... Um, what am I doing? The craft store? No, no, The painting no. section? No. Scrapbook. 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 But you know what? I never scrapbooked. That's a thing. Yeah. But Diaries. so many great uh, things. Uh, Stamping. No, no, no. Okay, guys, listen. <laughs> decoupage. So, so, decoupage, <laughs> kind of, sort of. Okay, so what I did is I cut part. Okay, you all just going to have to step out now because you're missing I will karate chop you, Kelly. I know you will. Okay, so we started with this little segment here. I thought this was real cute with the little bird. And, Tom, can you see that? Yes, all I right, can. So we put that in the middle. All right, and then what? What section is this from? Scrapbooking. From oh, scrapbooking. scrapbooking. Okay. Yes. And then this is such great stuff, isn't it? Mod, Mod, Podge. Mod Podge. And this one is Mod the Podge. Gloss Luster. Now, what I did after that, you glue this on with Elmer's glue because now you can't use hot glue for everything because it would no. it would make this bumpy. So no. we use the Elmer's glue. Then you go around this with the Mod Podge. You probably have to do it in sections. Now, if you can find some glitter with the little, uh, it looks like a salt shaker. You've got a little shaker on oh, there. Oh, yeah, that's it, nice. That makes it a little easier. You just shake it on there, and it will stick even to the sides. But I will tell you, this is a very messy project. Yeah, the glitter one is messy. And glitter is messy. And you will end up with glitter in your mm -hmm. house and stuff. So maybe a garage or even outside if you can find a place to do it. Yep, see, okay. that one is cute. And I like the really fine glitter because it, it looks is. really uh, it sparkly, is very the fine. fine glitter. All right. Now, Kelly, let me ask you this. Okay. Did you or would you... Mod Podge on top of the glitter. Have no, you about I, that? I hadn't thought about that. Okay. No, I was but, just curious. But what let you me tell you what I did, what, what would you do? I probably would to keep it in place so it wouldn't it wouldn't uh, come off come as off much. as much. Okay. Yeah. All right. What about so hairspray? You could definitely use hairspray. See, yeah. Tom, Absolutely. Who knew he was yeah. a crafty guy? Yeah. All right. So then I, I just picked things. out some words that I thought were were inspiring. We mm -hmm. have a few words here and a little butterflies. A few butterflies pattern stickers, patterns. which is nice. Well, we're yeah. going to use those on the next project. Oh, sorry. But okay. That's okay. Never mind. But I Way did use go. the mod. <laughs> I ruined it. Gee, I did use the mod podge the on here for a little bit of shine and to hold that on. And it will hold it permanently. And then I put a few little flowers because this is everything I love: inspiring words, flowers, and. Then we put the little bow on top, the little three or six loop bow there that it's you can very just. Very cute. And then I, I wanted a little bling in the center. So mm -hmm. isn't that cute? It's so cute. It's you know what those are called, Kel? What? what you're creating basically right now? What? When you hang something art in your home that does not have a frame, it's a gallery wrap. So you're See? creating gallery wraps with canvases, which is adorable. Check out and this. It's very popular. Check out this gallery wrap. There we there go. There you go. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're moving right along. Now this is a board that we cannot break. This is another canvas. Here. <laughs> Are you afraid I'm going to use my karate I skills now? I am afraid. I'm going to I'm going to step over here. And this is my sweet niece, she Sydney is so cute. Grace. Isn't she adorable? Her mother painted her face for uh, Halloween one year. Actually, this is several oh, years ago. Oh, thank goodness. That's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> She's a real butterfly, Tom. She's yeah. a butterfly. Okay. So now, Social look, boys. Butterfly. What did we do with this That's one? You guys are too distracting. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, so we used a few more of these stickers, and you can use them as you'd like. You can actually even put words on this frame, too. But I did mm -hmm. not paint this. You can paint the canvas. Uh, but I just like the contrast of the dark in the picture and then the white canvas. It's so cute. All right, and so we put these on, and then we added some sparkles. Now, with Sid, this is a little bit of beads that I had mm -hmm. extra at the house. I thought it looked good with her little Halloween outfit. I put her a little earring it's on It's like there. 3D. Made it is. It is 3D. Yeah. And then so then we put some of these a very expensive rhinestones that nice. I had for my Did share you? costumes. Oh, go ahead, Tom. Well, I was going to say you get a plain picture and then color her face any way you wanted. Then you could. Yeah. You yeah, would be kind of artistic, though. Yeah, no, I think that would be a really good idea. Did that. you Mod Podge on top of this or no? No, and let me ask you about that, Jerry, okay. because I, because it is a picture. I, was yeah. a, I didn't know if I could do that. It, it, it's risky, yeah. and I would use a credit card or some kind of sharp thing to really yeah. get the bubbles out if you do. Okay. Yeah, I was just curious what All you All right, very good. So it's easy to do at home. You all can take up this little crafty project and come out with some nice pieces. Yes. All right. Right, and that's what we're doing on today's craft. Hey, and coming up next, guess who's here with advice on how to fancy up your financial portfolio? Bruce Porter, dollars and cents. Is he going to be breaking boards? Maybe? I don't know. I think he may. He, he may. Breaks <laughs> he breaks the bank. That's right. that's right. We'll be right back.
With Color 10 News, it's Ozarks First, helping parents and kids with advice from a local pediatrician on when to have the talk with your teen. Plus, school kids tell us what's for lunch each day. And I'll let you know how your kids can dress for the school day. Color 10 News is putting Ozarks First. Semi-truck accidents are responsible for more than 12% of all traffic accident fatalities. If you or a loved one have been hurt or killed by a negligent tractor trailer, we want to help. Call me. I'm Thomas Morrissey, and I want to be your attorney. Do you have trouble falling asleep or wake up with a sore neck or headache? Then it's time you discovered MyPillow. Hello, I'm Mike Lindell, inventor of my.